In our last video, we talked about contamination and defects in paint jobs. In this video, we're going to talk about boot time and bottlenecks. It often seems that the refinishing process is where the workflow of the shop comes to a screeching halt. The booth seems to be the bottleneck of the entire operation. Refinishing is a time-consuming process and is not to be rushed. However, overcoming the challenge to keep vehicles moving in and out of the booth at a steady pace comes down to a little bit of planning. Although it can be difficult to predict when a vehicle will be ready for the booth, some foresight and communication can help you to get a good feel for what's coming and when. Once you have a good understanding of your work and process, it's time to build a plan for your paint shop and the use of the booth. Let's say you have several vehicles that need varying degrees of refinish work and are arriving in the paint shop today. How do you decide which to paint first? To answer this question, you'll need to consider many factors such as other opportunities to paint panels for one repair along with another vehicle in the booth, other parts that need to be pushed to the front of the line to be refinished or edged so the repair process can continue. The key is understanding the number of booth cycles you have available to you in a business day and building an efficient plan to maximize every one. Refinishing challenges are inevitable, but implementing solid standard operating procedures, ensuring that tools and equipment are properly maintained, and building a daily production plan for your refinish department will help make overcoming them possible and also help ensure a complete, safe, and quality repair. I'm Jason Stahl. Thanks for watching.